Welcome to the American Eagle Outfitters training video for system generated barcodes. Vendors now have the ability to print shipping barcode labels directly from AEO PLM. Printing barcodes from the system allows for efficiency gains and time savings, as well as eliminating opportunities for barcode and carton marking related chargebacks. To get started, log in to AEO PLM with your new barcoding user profile, which is provided by American Eagle. Follow the existing process to build and complete your packing list. You will notice that barcode prefix, start barcodes, and end barcodes are no longer required. The following fields are required before printing your barcodes. Number of cartons, packs per carton, units per pack, weight, carton type, and the carton sizing section. The system will not allow you to print barcodes before the required fields are populated. Once all of the required fields are populated, select the detail line or lines that you would like to print the barcodes for and select print barcodes at the top left of the packing list screen. You can print one or more lines at a time. The max barcodes you can print at a time is 5,000. Anything greater will cause a system error. You will receive a pop-up with a PDF that includes the system generated barcodes for the selected lines. You can print the barcodes using a thermal or laser printer using 4x6 labels. The barcode status for those lines will update to PRT. Any change to the required fields mentioned earlier will remove the barcode status and require a reprint. If you need to add cartons to a line, select that line and select the Add Cartons button at the top left of the screen. A pop-up will appear on the screen where you will enter the number of cartons you would like to add, then select OK. The number of carton field will update with the new carton total for the selected line. Since this is a required field, the barcode status will be removed and you must reprint the line. If you need to delete cartons from a line, select that line and select Remove Carton by Barcode Number at the top left of the screen. A pop-up will appear on the screen that you will use to select the cartons you would like to delete and select Delete. Closing the pop-up will update the number of carton field with the new carton total for the selected line. Deleting cartons does not require a reprint. Once all of the detail lines have a barcode status of PRT, you can approve the packing list. The system will not allow you to approve a packing list if all lines are not in PRT. Once the packing list is approved, you cannot add or delete cartons. You must follow today's current process to make changes to an approved packing list. You can reprint barcodes at any time by selecting the lines and selecting the Print Barcodes button. You can also view a list of the barcodes by selecting one detail line at a time and selecting More Details Barcodes. Please contact AEO PLM support at AE.com with any system related questions. The barcode printed from the system includes the carton markings and shipment details needed to meet AEO's carton marking requirements for most cell channels. This eliminates the need for additional carton markings with labels or pre-printed cartons. Here are some examples of cartons with AEO's new system generated barcode. This is a carton for the store selling channel. The new label replaced all minor and major side markings. This is a carton for one of our franchise selling channels, Alshaya Middle East. The new label replaced all minor side markings, however, the carton still needs the major side markings specific to the individual franchise channels. 
You can find the major side carton marking requirements for each franchise channel in the packaging section of AEO's Corporate Vendor Manual. Please contact Vendor Compliance at AE.com with any carton marking related questions.